My dad taught me about these. I'm a crack shot at this. You mean you have to use your hands? That's like a baby's toy. Hmm. All right, guys, Leo the video game guy here. I actually just found out that they're releasing, and I should have known because I'm a big fan. Uh, just found out they're releasing a new 30th anniversary Back to the Future limited edition set. It's called Back to the Future The Complete Adventures. It has all three original films, the, the original trilogy. And it also includes, it's either 23, like 24, 26, something like that, of the complete episodes of the, of the uh, original uh, TV series, the animated series, I believe it is. And find... You know, one of these copies of this this Back to the Future Complete Adventures edition, and I really hope I can find it here. Um, you know, I see a couple people walking in, and I just I just have a feeling they're here for the Back to the Future Complete Adventures edition as well. So let's see if I can find it here at Target, and if I can't, I'm gonna pop on over to Best Buy, which is just like a couple minutes away, as quick as I can, to see if I can score as well. Able to score the Target exclusive Steelbook edition of the Back to the Future 30th Anniversary edition. Real happy to get that in this bag here let's make our way over to Best Buy and see if we can find the complete adventures there oh oh one more one more oh look there's another one hiding over here someone put it back Thank you so much. Have a good one. You too. I got the Back to the Future 30th Anniversary Edition Complete Adventures. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited for it. So it's real cool to snag one of these up. I got it for $69.99. Let's get home and let's show you. I'll open, unfortunately I'm not going to open the steel book and I'm not going to open the Complete Adventures for you. I'm keeping those sealed. But I am going to open the original edition for you and just kind of show you what kind of special features come with each edition of Back to the Future 30th Anniversary. Stay tuned. Take me away. I don't mind. But you better promise me you'll be back in time. <laughs> All right, guys. So let's open this up here. See what comes inside this edition of Back to the Future. Real excited to get these copies, as I said. Cool, man. This thing feels nice. Very nice quality. Real excited that they put a lot of work even into the uh, this edition, just the basic one that's coming out. Because the one that came out before, you know, had a slip cover, the 25th anniversary, but it was just, you know, the regular, regular case. This definitely does this movie trilogy justice. This is a legendary movie trilogy, one of the best. Cool. So look at that. They show the uh, this is the original movie poster for the first Back to the Future. And uh, that's real cool to see that. And uh, got some photographs from the first movie there. That's Doc Brown hanging from the clock at the end of the first movie. There's uh, Marty McFly's mom. Wow. That's obviously Michael J. Fox, Marty McFly playing the guitar. That is George McFly right there. Love that actor. He's, he's a crazy guy, That the actor um, that, that played, played uh, George McFly. And uh, obviously Doc Brown. This is real cool. Real cool to see these. And obviously it comes with the Blu-ray uh, right there, and little little bonus features for just just this just bonus features for uh, if I'm not mistaken, yeah, just for disc one. So look at all these bonus features, deleted scenes, um, all kind of like tales from the future, something like some arc archival featurette, so Michael J. Fox Q and A, some behind the scenes stuff, and including some original makeup test outtakes, photo galleries. It's real awesome. That's just for the first one. Now here's a lot of Back to the Future fans' favorite film of the trilogy, Back to the Future Two. This is the one that features all the future stuff, the hoverboards, the uh, the, the, the the automatic lacing Nikes, as you can see there. Um, that, that's that's uh, Marty McFly's mother after she has a, a uh, breast augmentation for Biff, as he that's what he wanted. And uh, there's the clock tower in the future, so this is real cool. And then all kinds of bonus features. This seems like the same type of bonus features for the first disc. A bunch of Q&As and behind the scenes things, the original trailer. Things like that. 
to see this. This is a lot. Re, re, put, put a lot of work into this uh, this this uh, case for this trilogy. So I'm excited. Then this is Back to the Future Three, a hidden gem in my opinion. I think a lot of people, for some reason, this isn't a lot of people's favorite of the trilogy. I actually think this is you know, I, I mean, I know number two is my favorite, but this film, the the, the third one's really good. And that's Mad Dog Tannen right there. That's Clara. That's uh, Doc Brown. He ends up falling in love with Clara. And um, there's the uh, there's the the uh, DeLorean time machine on the train tracks, and that's them in the past. That's him when he first arrives. He puts on kind of like this costume. They kind of stare at him like what? But uh, and there's all the bonus features for that as well. And it looks like in the back here, there's the bonus disc. In the back here, there's a bonus disc with some bonus features. 2015 message from Doc Brown. Doc Brown saves the world out of time, restoring the DeLorean, and some other things too, including season one, episode one, and season two, episode one of the animated series, which is what I got in the complete, the complete adventures edition here. I got the complete um, series. Exactly. Awesome, as you can see, some other photographs here, and. Uh, Wow, this is just just re a real cool set. Very very excited to get this set, and then uh, even even more stuff here on the back page here of the booklets. And it actually shows the, these are all the dates that they actually did visit um, in the in in the uh, movie. 1885 was the basis of Back to the Future Three. 1955 was the basis of Back to the Future One. Uh, excuse me, Back to the Future One, and obviously parts of Two. 1985 was obviously the basis of Back to the Future 1, and obviously, you know, the entire movie kind of culminated with that date. And then obviously 2015, where we're at, and it's so funny to think that they thought this is where we we're going to be, you know, hoverboards and, you know, futuristic, futuristic clothing and, and, uh, think flying cars and virtual reality and, uh, but real, real awesome to get this. This is a real awesome, ser uh, awesome set. They put a lot of work into it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Sorry I'm not opening these two, but those are staying sealed. So guys, pop on over and pick this up. Pick it up quickly because this is real cool. We'll catch you guys next time.